I'm going to show you how to do that now. Um, the first thing we're going to do is create a null object. Now I just use Easy Layers which is a plugin for After Effects that lets me just click on the null and it will create a null for me, it will add motion tile and it will link the clip to the null on its own. Okay, If you don't have that plugin you're just going to go up to Layer New Null Object and then you're going to click and drag the parent pick clip to the null. Now once we have your null we're going to press S for scale usually about 10 to 15 frames in from the end. I'm just going to go to where the character stops talking in this case. We're going to put our first scale keyframe and then about three frames in from the end we're going to make the second scale keyframe at 120% to create the zoom in there. Now we're going to create a second null. Um, so again make sure you, you parent pick with that null to the new null if you don't have this easy layers. We're going to go about halfway between the two keyframes and we're going to make a new scale keyframe here. And then the second one, just leave it at the end, we're going to put it to 25. Okay. Now we're going to go back to our first layer, click and drag to highlight both F9 for easy ease and we're going to go into the graph editor. So this one is going to be a fast scale, something like this. And then the second set of null zooming out. F9 for easy ease, we're going to do a slow scale here, something like this. Okay, now we'll have a quick look at what this looks like here. That creates that fake zoom there. Now, next up, we're going to continue the zoom. Okay, so we need to create a second null layer or on the next clip. We just have to, again, we have to continue that zoom out look we were doing there. So we're going to go to the new null. We're going to go to scale and make it a 195 to start. And we're going to have the end at 100. Okay. Highlight the two keyframes, F9 for easy ease. And then we're going to create a graph, which is fast out, keeping a bit of movement like this. Okay. Now that will continue the zoom out as it goes there. So it makes it look much nicer. Thanks for watching guys, that's it for the fake zoom tutorial. Um, I hope you learned something from that and if you have any more requests for tutorials please let me know in the comments. Um, leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more tutorials. Thank you.